This is episode two. We're playing Land of the Vikings. So far, I'm really enjoying this playthrough. I think it's a it's a great game. Lots of potential. Uh, the nights are very dark. So let's see what we have to do. We got Goat Ranch done. It was suggested I should do a cow ranch or a, or a cattle ranch. Uh, so I'm going to have to uh, research the good houses. I kind of feel like, well, that might be all I can do for this season. I'm not sure when it comes to growing my crops. Uh, the following season, I'll have to redo all that. So let's look at our trees, our wood supply. So we're gonna have to fix that. It's great that they grow back quickly though. So I'm guessing we could build like a stone mine there. Yeah, we're just gonna build cut down all of these. Our stone's okay. We'll just do a little bit of this. That'll probably get in the way. And I think this stuff too. So there's uh, some homeless people. So we have to fix that straight away. I would like to build more houses out in this direction. I mean, I could go like right back here. I don't know if that's too far. Could fit one right there. I think this is probably a better spot. And I have like no no silver. So we're gonna prioritize that. So we are we are building a few things. But let's just prioritize the house. Because I do see homeless. So it'd be great if it showed like uh how much you've earned in the marketplace. So it's mostly just fruit, but hopefully we'll get some meat soon. I don't, so there's poultry. Okay, we're chopping those trees down. Yeah, I love the animations too. Okay, so it has that harvest symbol. Crops are ready to harvest. So I don't know like, are you, if I should uh, let it keep growing to the optimal area or... Oh, we're just in the summer, so I, I could potentially get a couple more crops. I mean, since it's ready, I'm just going to go ahead and harvest it. Uh, we got our storage there. I'm going to up workers. Well, actually, it might be... Uh... No, we got enough stone. So let's go up the workers that we have. And that's our total workers for everything. Our build, Our builders, I mean. And our population's only 26. Oh, so this will this will be done very soon, our windmill. And I guess I have like the wood storage and stuff.
Okay, so I'm gonna since we got the windmill built, I'm gonna get more free up more laborers. Okay, so they the advantageous talent is power. Let's sort by power. Yeah, these are just the two best guys. They're kind of a far walk. But that'll do. So uh, don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you haven't. And let me know uh, how you feel about the game. I'm really enjoying it. I think of it. I'm not sure if it's implement, implemented yet because this is an early access, but I think we can raid other villages. Like certainly it will be raided. So I know we can get a shipyard. We can get fishing boats and there's also, it looks like sort of like an expedition type boats, which I'm sure we can use to uh, raid other villages. So a cow just walked into the field. And the goats are leaving now. So I guess someone forgot to close the gate. Okay, so one of the workers must have died. Yeah, I wish there was a way for things to kind of like just auto replace. So power and speed. I guess it's this guy. It's a far walk. Maybe that's why the gate's left open. There's not enough workers. Oh, yeah, I got a plant. I wish this was auto as well. Just auto plant, auto harvest. I think a lot of people might, might uh, address this issue. And hopefully they do just make it auto. Either, otherwise, it'd be a lot of micromanaging. So... Okay, that looks like iron. The reddish tinge to it. So 26 people, plenty of food. Just a big shortage on... And wood. But we don't have like a ton of rocks, so I'm not going to mess around with the priorities right now. So this guy is in love or just very happy? Looks like a woman. Oh, got five silver. Yeah, it's taking a lot longer to build up some coin. Okay, good. Finally get this house built. I'm not sure if it's worth building a road yet. I mean, they're already pretty close. All oh, right, cause they got the stone storage. That'll be next. Because otherwise, you know, my logs are just laying around. So once the wood storage is done, it should be a massive boost in efficiency. So that's kind of a greenish tinge. That's probably copper. I'm sure this is a mineable thing. So that'll be exciting to get into uh, mining and smelting, building a blacksmith. I really want to get a tavern going. That, that'd be a great feel for the village. I'm sure too they're going to add things like clothing and maybe perhaps tools and stuff in the marketplace. I'm not sure if that's implemented yet. Okay, so the house is done. It's a really cool looking house. Okay, so let's just pause for a second and see what we need. 
and a lot of timber. Make sure I'm cutting everything though. Let's look at the tree of life. Yeah, so we're going to have to just build some more homes. Hopefully that way we can get some fame if there's more immigrants and things. Okay, we'll have bread soon too, right? So I guess that will help with uh, earning some money. I want to build a path just sort of straight out. I like to have a little bit of a curve. It's probably too far, but we'll put our shipyard right there. So production, we have stone cutters. We're going to need one of those so that we can build a shipyard. Oh, a woodshed. I forgot about that. So as we get close... So this is... Looks like the fall. But not sure how this thing's turning. So I'm going to need a woodshed. Or people will get very unhappy. And since I have the log storage there, I'm going to put a woodshed right here I think okay so this is where it the road snaps I'm gonna put a road between it won't build it now but that'll be the for the future okay so that's our next project Once they get all the resources there, then we're going to build a house up here. Yeah, there's so many logs just sitting out there. Sometimes it's just really slow to get the materials to the location. So I'm not sure, like, why are they not hauling things? It could just be they're so busy cutting down trees and stuff like that. Let's just look at the management for jobs. Oh right, the warehouse. So what does the warehouse store? Did I build a warehouse? I don't think I did. No, I didn't. So I could just from here, I was only two laborers. So from here, I could just add another marketplace worker. Yeah, so I think it's going to just like auto, auto choose someone. So I think two is fine for now. I'm just gonna have one builder. We need more laborers going and gathering things. I 
not plant this? Oh, I can harvest this already? So that grew pretty fast. Yeah, so the the wheel is turning sort of like uh, the opposite direction. So now we're in like the autumn and then winter is over here. I kind of thought it would be the reverse. Okay, it looked like he was hauling stone into there. Sort of curious what they're doing with that. Let's look at the warehouse and see what exactly does that hold? It's the place where products such as leather, wool, and clothes are stored. So yeah, I definitely want one. It'd be cool if I could uh, sort of squeeze it into there. Should sort of align it with this in a way. Then we'll build a road coming up through here. It's gonna be a lot of stone. Plant that already. Good, we're stocking up on some bread now. So the village population. Objective started preparation for winter. Yes, yeah, so I really have to get that built. I need two workers since there's two things here now. Yeah, this is just stone, and that's stone. Not sure why they're hauling it. I'm going to sort of free up some work. Maybe they're just, uh, you hold control and just paint over it to uh, cancel that. Just get a temper to go to wood cut in. Get temporarily cancel these jobs and see what happens. Yeah, there's a lot of jobs that I gave them. And we'll see if they start. Okay, yeah, that's, it's like they started instantly to go and hold a stone. Yes, yeah, so that was the issue. So I'm prepared for winter. Yeah, things are getting built much swifter now.
I'd love to have a tavern like right here or the other side. Yes, okay, so what's this? Winter is coming. Harsh winter is coming. Harvest your fields. Prepare the clothes. Last until summer. I didn't see what was down there. Yeah, I can't plant anymore. Uh, so I'm going to need a tailor, I guess. Action. There's my brewery. I don't have any barley. What is the... Well, we have to build a few houses. Place those houses eventually. So I'll get one there. And let's do a little bit of mining. It's a little bit of uh, chopping. Yeah, more homeless people. So that's a huge problem. Okay, uh, so two people died of illness. Yeah, I don't know how we're doing okay or not. We've got lots of food, We've got firewood, but I really need to, okay, I can lo unlock this. Let me just pause it. Oops. It's kind of weird how the space bar will pause, but if you're selected on something, just open it up. So. So we definitely need a shipyard. I feel like we're really behind if we can't get that tailor yet. That's four points too. So we're like, I feel like we're way behind. I'm not getting too many requests for people to, to move in. So once those two trees are done, uh, let's just start hauling pretty quickly. I haven't had any, oh, here we go. So some newcomers, they're running from their previous town. Get some fame here. So four points away to get in another point. The good thing is we have a lot more workers now. So I'm just gonna pause it and look at jobs. We got eight laborers. Carpenter, I must have uh, lost one. We were doing fine for timber, so actually I don't mind just having one there. Uh, two builders, two builders is fine too. Oh, it says I have, oh, one just died again, I guess. So I'll just automatically fill that slot. It might take a while just to update. We'll go to some to power. They're very strong there. So I thought I was doing much better this time, but it is a challenging game. A lot to learn. What should you prioritize first? I was really slow at getting my farming set up.
another out of stone. Let's prioritize stone mining. I think the jobs are split evenly between whether it's uh, stone, like that's a stone pit. So these are just general laborer jobs. There's a lot of people just sort of wandering around. No jobs. Get all hands on deck. It's finally being built. I'll put two builders and then we'll get another house. People must be those people must be cold. <laughs> I don't want people dying. I have uh, thirty people now, that's great. Tons of stone now. I'll prioritize this. Only two people. So there must be a couple families that moved in. Like there was one family that was homeless already. What's the issue here? Building storage is full. What does, would the warehouse solve that? Let's look at storage. The warehouse. Other woolen clothes. We could add some storage there as well. So that's okay for now because they're just full of like uh, herbs. So I'll get one house built, and I also need a doctor. Oh, that's... It's under life. It's an herbalist. I mean, we have the materials. Good. At least they're they're building a lot faster. Two people have died already. Third one died. Okay, the newcomers cause a settlement problem in the village. Foreigners set up tents wherever they find an area. It'll promise them a new home. Yeah, there's a lot of homeless.
Villagers are unhappy. People on the verge of revolt. If it goes on like this, the villagers will leave the village one by one. So I wonder too, I just build some like cheap temporary homes. for mining. Okay, there we go. There was a lot of people. Five people. So that's great. Uh, is that all of them? So we have warehouse worker. Oh, okay, so maybe they... Okay, they hold the herbs as well. So it's basically speed. That's the best skill here. This one's close by... So we'll get two of those. But also they hold. So like, this is where my yarn will go and the hides. So that'll be good. We'll prioritize this house. It's only 10 more stone. And this is like the pre-materials. And then I guess when it hits here, it'll reset. Yeah, so that was just the pre-materials. Now it reset. You need more. That's interesting. Yeah, so I thought I was doing good. Now things are not into <laughs> looking really questionable. I don't see any homeless. So I think it kind of tells you... No firewood. Oh, I must be short on... On uh, workers. Oh, here's the. Oh, it gathers fruit from the forest. That that's the. Those jobs I had. A laborer transports goods, cuts assigned trees and stones. So I don't know why it says there's no work. The labor is at the... There's still 40 firewood left. Okay, there. They're just showing up. It's like they were just uh, at home sleeping. This should eliminate any homeless. I don't see any. Oh, but two moved in. And I'll get the herbalist hub up. Okay, new houses. Do we get anything for that? Seems like our fame's going down. It's strange. Okay, we're like getting close to midway through winter. And I'm gonna need to cut some trees. I mean, food-wise, we're doing fine. You can definitely build some roads.
Yeah, I'll need a road up here as well. That looks pretty good. We have 28 people. The design in the buildings are really nice. There's a lot of detail in the things. It's hard to believe that this windmill would actually turn. It's so flimsy looking. Okay, so we'll use up some of those herbs. They, they want uh, high intellect. So, Ridger, <laughs> Ridger, Erickson, son of Eric. So that's good for winter survival, I think. Now we have uh, two points. Yeah, so maybe we, I shouldn't have, uh, I spent two points here. So I need two more for the shipyard. And then I guess that unlocks tailor, uh, the tailor. We'll see. Yeah, and uh, the next building we need to get is stone cutter. He'll produce dressed stones, and we'll need that for the shipyard. It's definitely like an industrial type building. Stone storage is just back, just nearby. close as possible. Stone storage is right there. I don't need so many builders. I should build, it's weird, like, why can't I build, like, Ken, you gotta, you can't get it too close. Kind of weird, like, it'd be, it's useful to overlap sometimes. I think this would be an okay spot. I could let room for like a road to go by. Oh, that's kind of finicky too. And my people keep dying. Well, they died naturally. I don't feel as bad about that. Yeah, this is really good. We're almost through winter. The next building I'll do is a shipyard for sure. This is probably a good area to do... Put a few more houses.
I think just poor houses are fine. This provides a good amount of workers for the area. Okay, speed. Surprising how often people die, though. They need food. I think I'll put uh, some uh, movement benefit type. So, some happiness and I'll move faster. Advantageous trade is power. It, that guy's kind of far away. And then now we can build this shipyard. Oh, I have to still have to research that. Well, the fishing hut will still work. I'm going to put one like right there. I think that'll be good. I'll just build a path. I guess like that. Yeah, he'll just like walk out to the ends of the pier. It's really cool. I'm not sure. Uh... Oh, more people. So I just built a house, didn't I? Right here. So we'll prioritize that. Got the pre-materials. So we'll definitely want these guys. They can join. Get some fame. I should have three points soon. I wonder if I'm losing fame like when people die for some reason. Anyways, I'm sure that the, with the different food types, hopefully there's a, be a happiness benefit. One, two, three, four, five. Is that, I think it's just like one family potentially that needs homes. I need to keep chopping wood. Anyways, guys, I think I'll uh, stop the video here. Please like, please subscribe if you haven't. Everyone's welcome to join the Discord. Links are in the description. And yeah, thank you for watching. I'm really enjoying this game. I hope you guys like it too. I hope you guys like watching. And I'll definitely just keep playing this game, make more episodes. I'll try to do a video every day for this. So please watch. And we'll see you on the next episode.